Five ways to increase your fiber. Now fiber is one of the key nutrients that you wanna to have to provide bulk to your food. It provides you to feel more full and it helps clean out your insides. But the thing about fiber is we have to understand that it requires eight times more water than a regular carb. So most of us think that, hey, I should be eating more fiber, but we don't understand that we need to drink just as much water to provide the process to get that fiber moving through your body. Now, the nice things about fiber is that it's considered to minus your net carbs. But if you're in a belly burn, I don't want you to worry about that. That's just a little tip that I wanted to tell you. So today's video, I'm gonna give you five simple ways to increase your fiber. Number one, my favorite is these Krizda chocolate chips. These Krizda chocolate chips are sweetened naturally with stevia, but they also have a high fiber total per 15 grams. And so these Krizda chocolate chips are very hard to find actually. We sometimes have them at the gym and sometimes they're available at local food stores, but it just seems like everybody's buying them. So they become in high demand. But if you can get a hold of these Krizda chocolate chips, I guarantee you it's gonna cure your chocolate fix. Number two is these delicious fiber gummies. Now these are more readily available. They're super cheap. They're a different type of fiber, but they're still gonna boost your overall fiber goals. They are a great way to cure that candy craving. Now I recommend that you don't eat these like candy because if you eat that much fiber at once, your stomach is gonna feel like it's a giant balloon and that it's going to explode. So only have the amount of fiber that your coach tells you in your belly burn or keep it to around 15 to 20 grams max. So these fiber gummies are available at the gym. They're available in the grocery stores. They taste great. Just don't eat too many of them. Number three is carbon nut bread. I've completely switched over to this bread. I love it. It's, seen, it's at Costco, Superstore, or any health food aisle. And it's usually in the refrigeration aisle because it has to be kept cold because there isn't a lot of like ingredients that regular bread have, and as such, it's going to spoil faster. Now, the nice thing about these carbonite bread is it tastes 80 to 90% as close to regular bread, but this is super bread. It's bread that's high in fiber, it's got a lot of great protein into it, and it's got a lot of different nutrients that normal bread wouldn't have. So carbonite bread is a great hack to increase your fiber while eliminating the typical bread and getting the most nutrients that you can from just a couple slices. Number four, a lot of people use these keto wraps. They're high in fiber. They're very similar to the keto bread, except they're in a wrap form. So if you're a wrap person, keto wraps is exactly what you need. And last but not least are food sources. So chia seeds would be your highest for the seed sources. You can also consume almonds and you can have raspberries. Now the thing about these food sources is that you have to make sure that you're tracking them within your MyFitnessPal or within the calories that your coach sets out for you. Yes, they are high in fiber, but we have to understand things like almonds and chia seeds are actually high in calories as well. So yes, you can consume too much of a good thing, but if you mixed it in with some ProGurt or you blended in some raspberries into your protein shake, then it's just gonna help to boost your fiber total up and it's gonna make them taste better and it's gonna be more nutritious and healthier for you. So there we have it guys, five simple ways to increase your fiber.